Chairman of the National Peace Council, Reverend Emmanuel Asante, has challenged employers to provide the required tools for their employees to be able to work effectively. Speaking on GTV's breakfast show on the topic Work Now and Work Then, the presiding bishop of the Methodist Church said the unavailability of these tools has led to a lot of people quitting their jobs due to frustration. And if I talk about the tools, I'm talking about the working environment. Things to work with. People get frustrated at work because they have been assigned responsibilities to do certain things, but the tools to go with it, they don't have it. Go to the police, go to the hospitals, go to other places. I've talked to doctors abroad who left this country because at that time of frustration. They think that things that they could easily deal with, they didn't have the tools and people were dying on their hands and they couldn't bear it. So the employer, you know, has responsibility to provide proper working environment, which would include the tools and the motivation that we are talking about. Work, you know, things that will commensurate with the work that people have been assigned to do. Unfortunately, that is not the case. He further urged workers to see their work as service to God and not just a means to an end. This, according to him, will prevent inefficiencies at work and solve the issue of low productivity. If work is not just a means to an end, but it is also an end in itself, and by that I think I'm doing service to God and humanity, then I do not just play through and, you know, malingling in, in, in work. I do not just go about just walking around so that at the end of the month I collect something, some pay to a work that I have not done. And you have situations like that. You go to offices. She was talking about what happens in, 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 in England and in other countries. You can't, Ghanaians go there and they work. You can't just be sitting around a, you know, a table as a receptionist, and when people come, you are on your phone, you're doing all sorts of things, and you'll be fired. 